Hi Taurus, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Taurus, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Taurus. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Eight of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So this is an energy of someone who is putting in work. This is someone who is fixing something, prioritizing something, very dedicated energy. Let's see. We have the Ten of Cups, Water Energy, the Five of Swords, Air Energy, and the Six of Wands, Fire Energy. Yeah, this person could be putting in work into this relationship with the five of swords you could have had a fallout with this person and they want to fix things they want to work on it this person's goal is to show you appreciation and to achieve that ten of cups with you they want relationship harmony and security with you they want something long lasting something long term with you and they do believe in the potential of this connection okay so let's clarify these cards taurus So we have the High Priestess and this is Pisces energy. So you have really drawn this person into you. It's possible that right now you guys may not be on speaking terms, but they are hard at work trying to think of ways to reconnect with you. This is someone who wants a second chance and wants to build and work harder this time around. So let's see, we have the Hierophant, Taurus energy. So they've learned a big lesson from this connection. The Four of Wands, Fire energy and the chariot cancer energy they're determined to succeed they believe in this connection and they do feel like whatever happened was just a bump in the road and that with some effort they can overcome that this person is wanting stability with you they're realizing that you're the only person they want to commit to and with the higher friend they, they would like a higher level of commitment they want to um you know make this connection into something more than what it once was or currently is okay so i'm gonna pull out an oracle card for you taurus Okay, we have balance, spirituality, and practicality. Full moon in Pisces. We have retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. And we have destiny. It is not in the stars to hold our destiny, but in ourselves. So they really do still want to get close to you. Um, they've been thinking a lot about this and they do feel like you, this connection, it's more than just a 3D connection. They feel like there's also something spiritual about it. And so it's something they want to keep in their life, something they want to prioritize more. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card for your advice. For Okay, we have surrender your attachment to results. The formula for success is to do all you can to make things happen. Then let go of the results. Holding on too tightly to a desired outcome can sabotage it. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Taurus. I hope you have a really, really good day, Taurus. Bye, Taurus.